What's up guys? All in wrestling system, Levi Jones here. And we're doing a dive roll, okay, from kind of this uh, sit the shoulder type position that keeps happening to a lot of people. The guy shoots in a high crotch here, okay, and it's all about like how to dive roll, right? So we've done it from our feet, we've done, okay, and we're starting to learn how to dive roll. And a lot of you guys out there are dive rolling and you're dive rolling this ankle, okay? But what we actually want to do is as we dive roll, we want to slip this this arm all the way behind his ankle here, or behind his knee, in this position, okay? If we do this, we're gonna be able to roll through and be here, okay? Now, from this position, if we're both parallel, there's gonna be a lot of scrambles, okay? General thought is get my knees under me, head high, wins. So if my head's up, I'm most likely gonna win. He's got my ankles, I got his ankles, and we're wrestling here. Head high is gonna win the battle most likely. Good technique, you ultimately wanna get back to, you know, a good te technical position like this, where you can score. So think head high if you scramble like that. But the thought, the second kind of part of this, is when you shoot, okay, and the guy goes dive roll here, okay? Now, me, knowing that that guy's going dive roll, I gotta know what to do next. So, you know, this, this is one thing I'll do. I'll float the hips. So I'll let go, I'll let go of this. We call it floating the hips. Here, we float the hips, and you'll notice as I floated those hips, I kept my body forward the best I could. Here, he went, he went roll. Okay, he went roll like this. Now, as I float my hips and he's rolling over, I keep my chest forward the best I can. If I can catch him on his back, great, but most likely, you end up in this position, okay, right here, where now it might be turned back into Brad's Granby, uh, Askin Granby, where they score, okay? But for me, offensively, I just really wanna get weight forward over this ankle, okay? I wanna get here, crack, hamstring, ankle, get my score, make this really hard to hang on to by sprawling and pulling it out. You can see he's rolling out his shoulder, okay? Pulling that out, we're pulling that arm out, drawing him out, getting him extended. Okay, so it's kind of a flow of scenario and um, situations when you get into these dive roll things. You really got to be able to react and know what to do. Um, but that is one. Like here, he goes dive roll. I float the hips. I let go of those legs. Now we're in this position. Okay. Now we can do a lot of things. Like I can come back over the top, kick here. Okay. So obviously, I can have fun with this, and we could go a lot of directions, and uh, it turns into a really fun scrambling. So just play with it, enjoy, know the fundamentals, know how to dive roll correctly, how to grab far ankle correctly, know when to elevate, etc., etc. Have some fun.